Hello there, math, math leads. Welcome back to Math Jamboree, where we demystify math problems step by step. In today's video, we're tackling logarithmic expression that's key, that's key for AP Precalculus. Stay tuned as we break down how to simplify it using basic logarithmic properties. So let's dive into it. Let A and B be positive constants, which of the following is equal to natural logarithm of A squared B minus natural logarithm of B cubed. So, before diving into this problem, let's review some uh, crucial properties of logarithm that will help us. The power rule. The power rule tells us that natural uh, logarithm of a to the power of b can be written as b times natural logarithm. Excuse me. B times natural logarithm of a, so which allows us to move the exponent in front of the log as a coefficient. Number two, the quotient rule. The, in the quotient rule, what we have is that the a over b, natural logarithm of a over b, can be written as natural logarithm of a minus natural logarithm of b. So, with this is in mind, by using the second property, uh, we can just... Um, rewrite our given expression so to do that natural logarithm of a squared b minus natural logarithm of b cubed can be written as natural logarithm of a squared b over b cubed so this b and b cubed cancel each other out and there is square left in the bottom so this becomes natural logarithm of a squared let me write it clearly natural logarithm of a squared over b squared so this will be the our final answer for this specific question. So if you will go through the choices, you will see that choice A will be the correct answer for this specific question. I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. If you have questions or comments, you can always leave it below there. Thank you. See you next time. Bye-bye.